There's chaos for commuters across our major cities as Extinction Rebellion protesters hold a second day of demonstrations. One protester suspended himself under the Story Bridge in Brisbane. Brendan Smith is there. Brendan, what's the latest? Well, Annalise, he is still hanging from beneath the Story Bridge. We have the water police circling below and a number of police officers above the bridge trying to work out exactly how to get this man down. We understand his name is Paul Jukes. He is a Queensland man and he has been hanging there for a number of hours from some sort of hammock-like structure and a number of ropes. There is a flag hanging below that says climate emergency, followed by the Extinction Rebellion insignia. As you mentioned, this is part of a week long of a uh, rebellion week as part of Extinction Rebellion's International Week of Disruptions. Yesterday, we saw a major march through the Brisbane CBD. Around 300 people marched from South Bank to the CBD. Seven people were arrested, including one uh, young man who has been dubbed a Brisbane pest, who's been arrested multiple times for uh, failing to move on as a result of these protests. He was actually banned from the city and police discovered him in a disguise yesterday wearing face paint and some sort of uh, red material over his face so police couldn't find him. But police did and took him properly to the watch house. It's likely he will face a magistrate today. But Back to what's happening here. As I said, there are water police circling from below. The man uh, looks quite comfortable sitting there. Obviously, he has a bit of uh, experience behind him being able to get into this position. It is believed that he uh, is fearing that this uh, so-called climate crisis will result in multiple bushfires across Queensland. Namely, he was referring to those Binnaburra bushfires that uh, did ravage the Gold Coast hinterland in recent weeks. It was believed, though, the majority of those were actually deliberately lit. It is understood as well. He has sent a message to uh, Premier Anastasia Palaszczuk. It's not yet uh, known exactly what that says, but it is likely um, calling on the state government to do more about this uh, climate emergency. The, one of the demands from Extinction Rebellion is to declare a climate emergency across Australia, calling on both state and federal governments to do so. So, Annalise, it doesn't look like he's going anywhere anytime soon. It will be very interesting to see exactly how police are going to manage to get him down.